stay tuned for the second part of this excerpt. Now going to the second part of the shuriken, we call it the middle part of the shuriken. The middle part of, part of the shuriken in what I call the lukewarm bracket it contains of people who are not living their full potential. They know who they are, but they are not living their full potential. You might have identified that the bottom, the, the middle part of the shuriken has some degree of uh, sugarness. That means you can easily identify it as a shuriken. But the most interesting bit is that 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 degree of sugarness it's not uh, up to full where would expect it to be and these are simply people who are living titles they know that they carry the titles but they are not living these titles to the maximum that is where again so many people are now what makes these people so comfortable with being in the rukum bracket number one they are always procrastinating you see today is the only time procrastination can guarantee if you need to do something you have to do it today again another thing that has always troubled people is that people are always waiting for perfect conditions there may never be perfect conditions in your life but you have to make the conditions perfect that's the key to progress if there are no perfect conditions make the conditions perfect create them create these conditions create these chances that's the only way to progress in life again the problem with the people in the in the, in the middle part is that they are always con always controlled by fear the fear of what will happen if you give your best whether failure whether success you need to give your best to attain the best that's a principle in life that you need to apply again coming to the bottom part of the shuriken in what i call the success bracket contains people who are living their full potential these are guys who have known who they are and they are living who they've known that they are that means they are living their titles this is where everyone ought to be the bottom part of the shuriken has a lot of sugarness that means it is living its title sugarcane that's where you ought to be but one thing to notice about the bottom part is that it contains so many birds that means it's generational that means the moment it's dead it will not be dead i don't know whether you are trying to get this the moment it's dead, it's not going to be dead, but it's going to be generational. In that, it has left some seedlings, some off, some offsprings to continue the generation. That's where we ought to be. The moment you are successful, you ought to recruit other people in the success uh, arena so that they can also continue with the progress, with the, with the process. As one man said that, have your name in the hearts of men, not on marble. That's who you ought to be what I call the shuriken analogy. Analyze yourself, see whether you are. We've talked of three things, the top part, the middle part, and the bottom part. Where do you lie? I, and I leave the question to you, where do you lie? If you're in the top part, endeavor to live in the bottom part. If you're in the middle part, endeavor to live in the bottom part. That's where we are going to be. That's where you are to be. Yeah. Okay, thank you so much for the main things you've told us. Now, how can we find you? Where can you find you? Are you in social media, Twitter, Instagram, or even Facebook? How can we find you? You can find me in Facebook, Kiama Alex. I also have a Facebook page called Living for Something. You can also find me on Twitter at Kiama underscore Alex. Well, I think I've sat here for now like five minutes and you look familiar to me. I'm the one certain book, Mimeanika Kitabu, by the way, certain book, Inspiration. Are you the one? You seem so familiar. Yes, 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 yes. I've done a book by the title Living for Something. It's a motivational book that focuses on five pillars. Yeah. Where can you get the book? Where is it? The book, uh, you can get it, uh, it's online in a publishing, in a publishing website called Smashwords. You can visit www.smashwords.com. You can also get it through me via my number 0714002190. I can forward it to you in soft soft uh, soft copy version or hard copy version. Yeah. Once again, the name of the book. The name of the book is Living for Something motiva uh, motivational book. Living for something. Inspiration. Inspiration. It's well, all about inspiration. I'm gonna get it today. Wow. <laughs> That's why we leave it for today. But for this and much more, 
catch up next week. Same time, same place. On the platform, Masuala Magumi. Don't be left out.